the saturday wrap is back yes it's the saturday wrap for a new month may 2024 and let's be perfectly honest it looks exactly like february 2024 rain cold and me moaning about it basically hello if you haven't seen this before this is me moaning on about the past week uh the politics the tech uh, maybe some beer uh, maybe other things a lot of weather mostly weather actually but what can you do anyway let's start off with the word or phrase of the week and it was especially yesterday and today elections yes we all had elections we all went out to vote except for me who did a postal vote about two weeks ago and what did we have in wales police and crime commissioners i have to be honest I think the idea is good the implementation is bad and they're a waste of money so i wouldn't have any um and i'd spend the money more equitably probably not on 20 mile an hour street signs for cars but what can you do um vote them out um okay so the app of the week so i didn't think i had this on my windows 10 box of age but winget and if you have a Mac, something like Homebrew, and it's an online repository of apps. So if you'd want to download Chrome or Brave or various other browsers from the command line, you can just use these things. And it's easy to keep things up to date and you can write scripts to update them and download them and re-download them. Winget, W-I-N-G-E-T. Uh, either run it from the command line or from uh, I can't think of the name of the thing you know uh, PowerShell that's the one or if you're on a Mac terminal and then it's brew um, just look them up they're really easy to use uh, if you like the command line which I do yeah Windows 11 is there I say like the wind to be honest um thing of the week well this week was one of those weeks where nothing much happens and it just goes along and then all of a sudden it's gone so my thing of the week i went to tesco's i have complained about pickled onions in the past that they're smaller not as crunchy and just not the same however the tesco's ones are not too bad they're not too expensive so my thing of the week and you can tell it wasn't a big week was pickled onions tesco's club card points were deployed or gained more correctly right okay song of the week um heart from the album 2004 jupiter's darling make me really really good and the album cover has a mandelbrot set on it yeah if you remember amigas and things like that and generating fractals and mandelbrots and the track itself is really wonderful really rather good um of a lesser known heart album um that's my opinion i have them anyway saturday saturday into newport where it rained a lot and it was windy and it was cold and i deployed my first uh weather spoons camera voucher so that was 50 pence off a pint and i didn't make it throughout the day uh, I didn't even make it to Weird Dad's. I gave up halfway and then came home in the rain and then I fell asleep. That's a sign, no doubt. Uh, and Sunday, um, planting time again. This time onto the Dizzy Rays. And I found out I'd actually ordered some roosters as well. So I have tons of potatoes. So bank holiday weekend ahead. I will be planting more stuff actually i've got some sunflower seeds uh thank you young colleague in work and some uh, tomatoes and cucumbers and peppers and this week i went into aldi's and i bought some of those paper fiber planting pots to save the world actually that was monday and i bought a much larger 10 liter watering can and it's probably rained all the week forward so i haven't needed it um yeah we'll probably have a drought though you know what it's like and today friday not saturday sorry um it's supposed to be 17 well it was this time last week that's what they said uh the weather forecast this morning said 11 i don't even know if you've reached 11. the week ahead looks warmer um but we shall see 
Uh, there you go. Uh, <coughs> cough. Tuesday. It was cold. It was very cold. Um, only because it's the wrong time of year. I'm not ready for it. Uh, it's like February. Uh, also on Tuesday, um, my indoor pots, which have radishes in it and such like, oh, spring onions, fill in planting. The bits that didn't germinate, the bits in between them, um, so that you have a continuous crop. Coming along nicely, actually. But there you go. Uh, Wednesday morning. Um, I managed to cut myself twice with an electric shaver. Uh, looking at the foil, it had ripped and it had turned into a nice little knife. Um, prime next day delivery sorted out. It's supposed to come at 10 o'clock at night. Um, it actually came at quarter past two in the afternoon. I know that because they sent me a picture, which was rather good. Thursday, smashed the glass. Um, swept it up, swept it up actually with a dustpan and brush, which just collapsed in my hand. Prime, new and on the way, coming tomorrow. And Friday, today, uh, getting ready for Logfest 15. Bragdy Tut Lol, the brewery of little laughs on the Tree Forest Industrial Estate. Um, Logfest 15 is on today and tomorrow. I'm going tomorrow. There's supposed to be a burger van going tomorrow, but one of the people running it is in now in hospital, so they're desperately looking around for more food. Please make sure it's a burger van. Don't like pizzas, melted cheese. I know that's sacrilege, especially in Wales. Um, but yeah, burgers, please, or chicken burgers or just chips they'll do for me um i will be sitting in the corner drinking fine ales supporting local welsh breweries and yeah i'll be looking forward to it i think it's an early start i think the weather forecast says sunny and dry and relatively warm only time will tell that's why i will be sitting inside in the corner just in case on the um 3uk 5g via smarty uh, usual comments, please. Thank you. Bye.